we're talking about Dan Sweeney. Yes. You went to school with him? He was I did. He graduated a year after me. I was in the shows with him here, actually. He was a lead in the show. When I was a senior, he was junior. He was one of the leads. And very nice kid. And it was great to be with him. Very quiet. It was, he, he was the kind of kid you wouldn't expect to be the lead in the show. Uh, so it was neat to be able to be on stage with him. Do you and, remember uh, what show? Or I what? do. He was Prince Charming in Cinderella. Um, it was neat. You know, very quiet around the building, not talkative. And then all of a sudden, you go to practice, and here he is singing and dancing. Um, Caught up with him over the years. Um, we would see each other at, his sisters did the shows here at school. And so I would see him here when we would both be at the show watching. And then afterwards, we would just catch up. Uh, he would tell me what he's been doing, I would tell him what I've been doing. And uh, he was an EMT, and he, he loved doing that. And then I knew he was going into firefighter school. And uh, real passionate about it, and enjoyed what he did. And that's really what he had set out to do after he graduated from here. That's what he wanted to do with himself. And we remembered that when he was a student here, that that's what he wanted to do, and he certainly did, and he helped a lot of people doing it. How's it for the school community here? It's It's been sad, I and mean, it certainly hits home because he was part of our family, and his whole family has been too, um, over the years, and still to this day, um, with his mom being here every day teaching, and his siblings, the youngest daughter, sister just graduated, so we have the flag at half staff, and we'll have a memorial service here at some point within the next month where the family can come back and kind of we can remember him as a McDevitt community with the family here as well.